Is life and welcome back to my channel and I'm gonna be back with another video so right now obviously it is 7 35 right now I know it's kind of late for me to film a video I don't know if you guys can see that but I know it's kind of late for me to film a video but I wanted to film this video because I know that Saturday I may not have the time to film this video and obviously I'm in a different space so um, my original filming spot I'm gonna film a video on Sunday so I can just push out some content for you guys to watch because I really want to be back consistent on this channel and I really want to get to 500 subscribers this year I know I've been slapping slacking I'm sorry because like I've been really busy so I've been slacking and I'm sorry um but before we get into this video what this video is going to be make sure you guys smash the like button get this video 35 likes subscribe down below and get me to 500 subscribers if you subscribe to me I will subscribe back and make sure you push on that post notification so you can get notified every time your girl posts a new video and yeah, without further ado, let's get right into so, the video. Today's video is going to be me talking about my dorm experience. Now, like, if you guys know, I probably haven't really been talking about it like that, but I've been in the dorm, and I still am in the dorm. Not right now, obviously. But right now, well, before, I was in a temporary dorm for like five weeks. And I'm just going to explain, like, my experience and what you should expect when, you know, you ever go to college or whatever. I'm not in college, but I still am in a job program where you stay on campus and you stay on dorm. So that's what I'm going to be talking about and um, my experience, my first time experience being on a dorm. So I hope you guys like this story time. I know I haven't been doing a story time in a while. So I'm gonna be sure to keep this video not lengthy, not really lengthy, I should say. So yeah, this is really Don't you just love Capri Suns? Capri Sun, sponsor your girl, okay? Please sponsor me, cause I can't drink Pepsi right now. But sponsor me, okay? Sponsor me, Capri Sun, what you doing? Sponsor me. Young Mula, baby. Hey. Okay, no. Definitely gonna get another one of these before I leave. But anyway. Okay, so let's just get right into this first time dorm experience. Okay. So. To first start off with this dorm experience, I stayed in this dorm which was my temporary dorm for like five weeks. And it's like the beginner dorm. And in the program, you stay in there for like, they usually say normally you stay in there for like three weeks and then they move you um, to your permanent dorm. There's another way that you can stay on that dorm, but I'm gonna talk about that in another video. But right now, <coughs> um, I'm going to be talking about um, the experience I had. So, for my first week, um, they do help you make up your bed and, you know, get the corners right because there's certain corners, a certain way you have to have it. Um, I'll probably insert a picture of, like, a Google image of it that I found online um, about how the bed should look like. And then they usually want you to dust. So they want you to dust like the AC. And they want you to dust like on top of the lockers or whatever. Like that's in the room. Including your roommates as well. So whoever does it, dusts everything. And then you sweep. And that's basically what you do. And then you have a thing where on Wednesdays you clean up the room. You have to move the beds. You have locker checks and everything so like your locker check your locker check i can't speak honestly was like it was kind of hard for me because 
Like I had to be, say, organized, and if it wasn't really fully organized, then the RA would have to come back. And then once it was fully organized, then, you know, it was like, um, better or whatever. So they do that a lot in the first week. First week is kind of like, you know, you really don't do anything, to be honest, because you're kind of like excused from like, well, I was excused for doing, you know, chores. So I really didn't do nothing on my first week. I had a pass. But for the remainder four out of the five weeks, I was, I had night a night chore for like two whole weeks. And my night chore was like um, cleaning the shower. So I had to pick up the hairs out of the drains and all of that. And um, my night chore and was that's for like two weeks. And then you change chores. So you change chores every two weeks. And then I had a morning chore, I think after those two weeks, when I got to like my third, fourth week, I had a morning chore for like those two weeks up until the time that I was moved into my So my overall dorm. first dorm experience was different. I would say it's different living with people because like, especially girls, especially girls, it's completely different because you never know what you're gonna get, what's gonna happen, what to expect, and all of that. So honestly, like, um, did I like my first dorm experience? I would say yes and no. I feel like over there was very like, you gotta do this, you gotta do that. So like very strict. And um, honestly, like, I don't know, like I just, like, I don't know, like, I like strict, but I would say I'm not a person that likes being, like, that likes to have a lot of strictness, if that makes sense. So, like, my dorm experience was kind of good, I would say in the beginning, but kind of bad. But right now, I enjoy being in my permanent dorm. Um, I'll explain more about the whole, I would say, just about the just more detail in another um, video because we're only talking about my first dorm experience and I want to be able to compare the two so that's why I'm going to make a whole other video where I compare the two where I compare my first dorm experience to you know my actual permanent dorm experience because they're going to be having some type of differences I'm trying to see how long this is six minutes okay I'm fine um so yeah honestly would I recommend living in a dorm, um, like in a job, whether it's a job program or uni? Of course, uni, which is university, would be different from, uh, kind of different. I would say kind of different from my experience. I would say that I would recommend being in a dorm. Yeah, it can get a little hectic at times because you have like different personalities that you deal with and stuff but like other than that I feel like that's one way to be independent because like when you're with your parents at home and like you live with your parents and you're always by yourself you know it's different because you get used to that you know that's if you don't have any other siblings I have an older sibling like how I mentioned in my first time tag video if you have a go see to go watch it it is funny because you know it's funny but I'll probably put a picture over here and link it in the description box but yeah um I would recommend being in a dorm um honestly it's not for everybody there was one girl that left after like two weeks because it just wasn't for her and that's okay um but I mean I like being in a dorm because like you get to connect with people one on one and you know you're not just like seeing them during school hours because you get to meet different people from who are achieving different goals and um just have different conversations you know and you don't have to like come home if you don't want to come home you know that's the beauty of it you know and then when you do live on your own and by yourself it's like you tend to appreciate it a whole lot more because you have the experience um, of like
like living with other people and seeing what that's like, you know, because basically everybody's your doormate, you know, and that's basically all it's about, you know, so yeah, sorry if I feel a little, if I'm sounding a little sick, guys, I'm still a little sick, so um, I'm still a little under the weather, I went to the hospital like Sunday, like November 3rd, like so I'm just recuperating right now. <coughs> um, so yeah, that's basically my dorm experience. I know it wasn't like super hype or nothing, but yeah, I mean, there's some funny moments too. You know, you really get to connect with the girls. I forgot to mention that. And um, you have the meetings in the morning, and you have a meeting at night, and. That's basically how it is, so, you know, in either dorm, it's the same way. So, yeah, I definitely would recommend uh, being on dorm. It's better, I mean, it's different from being, you know, at home. Um, it's nice to come home when you need a break, and that's the beauty of it. That's what I like about it, and I know this video wasn't, like, super hype or nothing. Um, there was, like... There is, at times, a little bit of drama, which I be trying to stay out of, or whatever, to be honest with you, because I just feel like minding my business is better than being in somebody else's business. The tea, sis. But anyway, yeah, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe.